What is happening, collectors? Yes, 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 you saw the thumbnail and I'm gonna show you that card, that blank card, that very special card I got back from CBG, uh, CGC. But before we do that, I do actually wanna open up a couple packs. Um, I just got this, this is the Mimikyu EX box. As you can see, I got it from GameStop up here in Canada. Um, I'm an Edge Platinum member, so it was $31.49, which is a little bit pricey for only four packs. Um, let's just quickly take a peek because this is the first time, not the first time actually, it's because uh, there was the Paldea collection boxes, but this is our first look at an EX card. So this is the Mimic U EX. Um, as I think other people have mentioned, it does kind of look washed out a little bit, um, you know, not as vibrant. And I don't know if that's just because it's Mimic U or if that's what they're all gonna look like. Um, but as you can see, this is a Black Star promo. So SVP, uh, uh, which is the promo card, Scarlet Vi Violet promo number four. So con comment down below, what do you think? Is this, are you excited about the EX cards coming back? Or yeah, what do you think? And the other one, and I actually love this card, Grievered, which is a cute little pooch with a little candle on his head. And it's got the hollow border there. So kind of taking the cues from the Japanese, I think it is, awesome i love it but maybe you don't let me know down below what do you think so here's the jumbo card so that is the same size as other jumbo cards so we're gonna open up two packs here and then i'm gonna show you that awesome um uh card i got back from cgc and what it was graded so in this we've got a fusion strike two silver tempest and a brilliant stars so let's open up you know what let's open up the fusion strike fusion strike was never really my i would say favorite set but uh it does have a lot of really big hits in it which is which is kind of interesting so we won't go man these cards are very very glossy that's kind of interesting i don't know if that shows up on camera or not but it's quite vibrant oh a double clobopus and a gudra non-holographic so uh, yeah, there we go. There is that. But yeah, Fusion Strike has grown on me. Silver Tempest, I'm still missing some. Uh, I want to get more of those, the, the Alolan, um, Alolan Vulpix cards for my daughter. I think she would really, really enjoy that. So, you know, let's just, let's just go straight through this because I'm excited to show you that CGC card. Indeedy, uh, Araquanid, Ara Milotic, nothing special. Okay, so I'm gonna cover up the top here and look at this. Yes, oh, you can see me in the reflection. So yes, I got this blank card um, from, I believe if my memory serves me well, it was an Evolving Skies, I think it was Evolving Skies, um, Build and Battle box. And it was within the pre-pack uh, of cards. And it was the very, very back card. Now, the one thing I will say is the condition of the card was particularly bad. Um, and I don't know if it's because they know that the cut edges are often gonna be bad or, or who knows why they put the, the cards there, but it was particularly bad and it came back as a seven, <laughs> which is pretty bad. But, you know, I, it, I, honestly, I'm not surprised and I'm not mad because this is actually a really, really cool piece. It's really unique. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it yet. Like, I don't know if I wanna sell it or keep it. I think I'm gonna keep it because it's it's kind of a unique piece. And when you think about it, you know, it's it's rarer than, you know, any given Charizard for the most part, right? These, not many of these are out there. And now I have seen people get them and TCA Gaming, he has got a bunch of them that he's uh, sent out for grading as well. But um, it's a pretty rare piece. So I think that's gonna stay in my collection. So uh, anyways, what do, you, what do you guys think? Have you ever seen that before? Uh, what do you think of it? Leave a comment down below. And let's wrap up with these last two packs here. This is just a short little video today. Um, and for those that haven't seen me before, hi, my name is Mark, I'm the Millennial Collector. Please hit that subscribe button down below. If you're new here or if you have not been subscribed, I would love for you to join us on this channel. So there's a code card for somebody. Uh, Silver Tempest, yeah, so I still need actually, this is the only set from the Sword and Shield era that I don't think I ever actually opened up a booster box. I don't think. Um, which is kind of funny because this is a set that I do enjoy. Um, but anyways, let's see. Oh, there we go. Hey, we got a Jinx from the Trainer Gallery. I definitely don't have that because I don't remember ever seeing this artwork before. It's probably not worth a heck of a lot. I'm guessing $1, maybe two if we're lucky. And we've got a Superior V-Star. So that's a little double banger pack there. That's not too bad. And we're gonna finish with some brilliant stars because you know, there's Charizards in it. And like, why not finish with a Charizard? Um, like an alt art Charizard or even a full art Charizard. I mean, hey, 
let's get let's let's get crazy here why not get some get some good luck so yeah again i appreciate you guys clicking on this video i've got uh, some more good content uh certainly on screen at the end of this video i would recommend you just go check out something maybe you haven't seen before I've got a lot of unique different content somewhere i travel somewhere I open up pokemon cards some with a little bit of everything so muck what an ending have an amazing day